Hello and welcome. My name is Alan and we are back with more members of the 118th Congress. Today, we are looking at Representative Clay Higgins, who represents the 3rd District of Louisiana. That is the lowest uh, southwest portion of the state. Now, he is a Republican, and before he took office, he was preceded in office by Charles Bustany. Now, let's take a look at who he is as an individual. He was born in New Orleans, Louisiana on August the 24th, 1961. Graduated from Covington High School in Covington, Louisiana. Attended Louisiana State University in Baton Rouge, Louisiana from 1979 to 1983 and from 1989 to 1990. Was a member of the U.S. Army, a member of the Louisiana Army National Guard, been a business manager, deputy sheriff, the St. Landry Parish, Louisiana Deputy Marshal um, in Lafayette, Louisiana, before being elected as a Republican to the 115th and three following Congresses. So, term four. Now, let's look at the committees he is on. He is on the Committee on Homeland Security, of which he's on the Subcommittee on Emergency Preparedness, Response, and Recovery. He's on the Subcommittee on Border Security, Facilitation, and Operations, of which he is a ranking member Do he is on the subcommittee on transportation and maritime security. He is on the committee on oversight and accountability, of which he is on the subcommittee on government operations in the federal workforce and the subcommittee on national security the border and foreign affairs now let's look at the top five industry donors over his career at the top we have leadership packs who all together have donated a total of 212 thousand nine hundred and eleven dollars next is oil and gas who all together have donated one hundred and seventy seven thousand seven hundred and seventy six dollars next is retired who all together have donated one hundred and sixty six thousand nine hundred and fifteen dollars next is crop production and basic processing who all together have donated $154,999. And in fifth is Republican, Republican and Conservative Organizations, who all together have donated $110,048. Now, let's look at his top five individual donors and contributors over his career. At the top, number one, we have LHC Group, and the company provides home-based services through home nursing agencies and hospices and facility-based services through long-term acute care hospitals and outpatient rehabilitation clinics. Altogether, it has donated 
$1,050. And once again, that's the LHC group. Next, at number two, we have B&G Food Enterprises. And the company offers the retail sale of prepared foods and drinks and serves customers in Louisiana, Texas, and Mississippi. Altogether, it has donated $45,600. And once again, that's B&G Food Ser er, Enterprises. Next, at number three, we have the House Freedom Fund. And that is the uh, monetary arm, more likely, of the Freedom Caucus, which is Republican members in the U.S. House of Representatives. Altogether, it has donated a total of $42 thousand three hundred dollars and once again that's the house freedom fund next at number four we have acadian companies and acadian has been committed to providing the highest level of medical care and transportation possible according to what it says Altogether, it has donated $38,645, and once again, that's the Acadian companies. Next, at number five, we have the Eye of the Tiger Pack, and that is the political action committee that is headed, I believe it was by Steve Scalise. Um, altogether, it has donated $37,500, and once again, that's the Eye of the Tiger pack. Yeah, um, industries, retired's great, crop production and basic processing is great, the rest of them, ooh, uh, not really. And then as far as uh, individual donors and contributors, it goes from eh to eh. So yeah. But this has been a look at Representative Clay Higgins, who represents the 3rd District of Louisiana. As always, educate thyself, think, read, study, learn. Someone tells you something you have trouble believing, ask them to cite their sources. I'll be putting links in the description box below the video. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Until then, later.